beautiful people, I am back! And I am back with a product review. Um, so, um, for a while, I've been using this product. Um, I didn't want to, I didn't do a product review before because I just had tried it. <laughs> So I didn't know, you know, how it actually works, if it actually did what it said that it would do. So, um, you know, I've been using it already probably for like a month and a half, two months, right? Um, so basically, um, it is the Fenty Beauty Skin Care. Uh, Fenty Skin, is that what you want to call it? So I got... To try it, I only bought the uh, like travel sized uh, set and I've had it for about almost two months so a little does go a long way because I'm already going on two months um, about using this. So I was very intrigued because I saw the ad of, of course, if you don't know Fenty, who Fenty is, it is Rihanna. Uh, and um, this is her skin line. This is the Rihanna skin line. And um, I saw her um, ad on it. And what intrigued me the most was she said that after you use it for a certain amount of time, your skin tone kind of becomes very even. You know, basically you will have one skin tone. So I suffer from hyperpigmentation. I usually get it around here or across here. And my eyes are pretty dark. So um since using it for the last two months month and a half um i definitely have noticed a change in my skin um especially in coloring and um just the texture and the feel of it also um and i love it i really really do love 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 it um so it comes with a face wash a total cleanser which is also made to be a makeup remover and a cleanser um, at the same time remove it all cleaner that's the name of it and you use day and night removes makeup dirt and impurities what I will say about this is that it does not remove your makeup 100% I've had face makeup on, my mascara or eyeliner, and it had not removed all of it. Most of it, yes, but there was still residual behind. And um, so I would still suggest um, removing makeup before using the face wash. Um, I have other face wash that I use. I use Neutrogena face wash, which, which also says removes makeup and dirt and impurities as well. I find that one to actually remove it better than this one, but not to take away, it still does, um, it still removes makeup, but you'll have to do, go over your face um, again with um, a cotton ball around your eyes especially. And um, so that's the one thing I will say about the cleanser. Um, but it does leave my face feeling very nice, very smooth, and it has a really nice scent. Um, it also... So I use like the littlest dime size amount. Um, I just had it upside down somehow. And it's like, uh, it has like a, a pearly kind of sheen to it. I mean, I use a little more than this, but I just wanted to show you guys the look of it. So it's kind of pearly and sheeny and stuff, but it doesn't leave any of that behind. But it's nice, it's creamy, um, it's it's thick. And I use a little bit more than that on my to wash my face because it's, it's very creamy and it suds up very, very nicely on the face. So I just wash my face, so... This is Miss Lupe Bear Bear Bear. I have absolutely nothing on my face. As a matter of fact, I am super dry. <laughs> so I have nothing on my face. Zilch. So that is the uh, the cleaner. It smells very nice. It's very light. It's not overbearing. 
so it does smell really really nice so that's the one thing I would say about the cleaner now moving on to the fat water my favorite <laughs> I love 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 I love this this is the one thing I was really really excited to try and this is I guess a uh, part of the miracle worker of keeping your face nice and even toned so yeah this is I really really like that and it also it's uh, for pores uh, refine pore refining so yeah it's wonderful so I just washed my face and everything so I am going to put my amount so I just dabble a little like you guys can see that's just it put it between both hands and pat it all around my face I put it I put it on my eyes around my eyes and most importantly around my mouth because this is where I get the most um, discoloration or hyperpigmentation I should say um, especially in the summertime I don't know this area just seems to get very dark and I'm looking like I have a mustache but I don't y'all I don't I just have this discoloration <laughs> so yeah so off the bat you can see that it looks nice shiny it gives you a nice feel on your face there is no tingling or anything to this um, at all so that is the fat water. You don't feel anything. Um, though when you do put this on, it's not like a water. It kind of has like a, I don't want to say oily, but it does have a thicker consistency um, than just it being water. There is something in it that gives it a more thicker consistency. I don't know what it is, but um, it's not just really watery or anything. Like most toners that they're just like really watery, you just squeeze it on a cotton pad and put it on your face. That is not like that. And this um, I put on with my fingers and it says to apply over face with fingers. So I wanna do that because I guess the cotton will absorb whatever is in here. So it's not oil and water mixed because obviously the oil would be sitting at the top or at the bottom or something like that anyway yeah so I love this I have no complaints about it it leaves nothing on my skin I don't feel sticky and automatically you can see it kind of gave me just like a nice little glow without anything else right so now I'm gonna go in with the Hydra Visor which is the uh, the face cream um, this face cream is also a, um, uh, God, what's the, I'm looking for the word. <laughs> it also has sunscreen in it. <laughs> it also has sunscreen in it. Um, it's not, um, a ton. I'm going to see if it says it here. Um, it doesn't say what SPF. Oh, it does. It is Broad Spectrum SPF 30 Sunscreen Invisible moisturizer so it's also it's a moisturizer and a sunscreen which is a plus I have yet to find a moisturizer with sunscreen in it that does not break me out I always break out with um, any moisturizers that I've used and I've used quite a few different brands um, and I always break out so I never really put I know it's bad to say I never really put um, any type of uh, sunscreen on my face which is bad and then I'm getting older I'm realizing no you need sunscreen girl your face and your skin <laughs> so anyway so this like the um, cleanser is this pinky pearly kind of color I use about um, three pumps this is what it looks like it's just like a pinky kind of color I don't know if you guys could tell like baby pink um, and it also has that like pearly kind of look to it and just three pumps is good enough and I just put that everywhere on my face neck and they all have the same scent uh, except for the fat water that doesn't really have any type of um, scent to it but this 
one and the moisturizer, I mean, the cleanser and this do have a scent. But it's very light and it goes away very fast. And I just apply this all over my face, especially here. I always get dry around here. And I just work that in. And you can see it kind of just gives me like a really nice glow. Um, and I love it. So I use about three pumps of this. So three, and I use this twice a day, day and night. And I have no complaints about it. I'm really, really liking this line. I am going to get the full, uh, the full bottles, but I really just wanted to try it, so I didn't feel like I'm gonna spend all, all the money. Um, and I think the set, the travel set, was only was about forty bucks for the whole little kit. So forty bucks to try it, you know. Not bad. I just wanted to see if it actually really did what it did, how my face was going to react to it, and I actually love, love, love it. So you can see, and even though I still have like this like glow or anything, like my face does not feel greasy or anything. So, and then after I do that, I go in with the Fenty Flash Nap. That's for the eyes. Um, I've been using this for quite a while sometimes. Uh, Sometimes I've been using this cool for quite a while um, and I use it all the time I don't there's not a day I don't go and I use it also twice a day I do notice a difference in my eyes um, I do have dark circles um, again but since I've been using it I find my skin is more clearer and I do have under eye bags um, sometimes they're more visible than others depending how stressed I am if I've been emotional or <laughs> If I didn't get enough sleep, so sometimes they're more pronounced than, than other days. Um, but this I found has helped my eyes a lot in this area, um, especially with the bags. So um, now this I always um, I put on day and night. And I put it all the time. I put it around my whole eye. Like, I don't just put it under the eye. And I'll go in with this little bit. I'll put a little on this side. And a little on this side. And I put it everywhere. Around the whole eye area. And then I'll go in on this side. And I'm using the lightest touch. I dab a little and then and sometimes I rub some in and that little dot that I showed covers both eyes perfectly you don't need any more um, and I noticed also because I used to get um, dry patches like right here on my eye um, and this has helped me a lot with that also I haven't had them in a while so I am going to contribute to this because I don't really use anything else under my eye except for this. And um, that's that's it. This is pretty much my um, routine of washing my face, what I use. And you can see like it gives a nice glow to the skin. I can go out pretty much like this. I would just throw a little bit of under eye concealer and a little bit around the nose and here. And I will be gone for the day. Um, I'm not, I do use makeup, um, but I am not heavy on like foundations and stuff like that, except unless it's like a special occasion or something like that. Um, then I'll use, you know, it has to be like extra special for me to be do, using some foundation or unless I'm doing like a makeup tutorial or something. Um, but yeah, so. I absolutely love the Fenty skin and um, I would re definitely recommend it. Definitely recommend it. If you have used it, let me know your thoughts on it. How did your skin turn out after? Um, like I said, I've been using it for about two months and I love the, um, the outcome of it so far. And I'm gonna continue using it. I'm gonna get the bigger one um, and keep going with it. <laughs>
So I don't know, you know, how much clearer my skin is going to get. If the, I mean, it's been two months, so I don't know. I don't think it's gonna get much lighter than what, it, you know, the pigmentations are gonna get much lighter than what it is. But um, it's definitely worked for me, and um, I don't think there's a, a product that's gonna be like super. It's gonna take everything away unless like you're bleaching your skin, and this is not what that is doing. So um, yeah. So it's, like I said, it's very nice, it's airy, your face feels really nice afterwards, and um, typically, this is just how I'll walk around for the day, and uh, continue on from there. Put a little bit of mascara, and I'm good to go. <laughs> so if you guys wanna try it out, try it. I definitely recommend it. Uh, Fenty Skin, Rihanna, get yours, try it out. Let me know what you guys think. Um, and that's pretty much it. I will catch you guys on the next one. As always, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Comment down below because I do read your comments. Also, guys, if you have not checked me out on my OnlyFans page, go show your girls some love. OnlyFans.com slash Miss Lupe. And I will catch you on the next one. Later!